Hello and welcome back to Tyson's Fair Program. I'm Ivan. Now in the last episode we set up our um, particle containers and we set up a lot of them because they are used uh, in the mall. They're going to be used for... I think it's the buildings, these ones, yes. Uh, that's the logistics stations and it's going to be used for science because these lead to these which lead to space warpers or science I believe graviton lens should be a part of the next one yes it is so um, today we are going to look into look into different materials we need for them all we're also going to do a bit of maintenance because we need a bit of maintenance and and um, the game has been updated. We now have this upgrade button so we can upgrade belts and assemblers um, or assembling machines. I'm not going to upgrade the assembling machines because I feel like um, the ones in the malls uh, in the mall are working fast enough and the other ones drain more power. So I'm going to leave it at this, but if we find out that something can't keep up, then we'll uh, make changes. Like here, here we see that these aren't keeping up, but it's not because of the machine, it's because of the input being lacking. And I'm looking at this iron mining site and apparently it's not mining enough. So let's add more to it. And let's see. Why why do these have their own smelters? It's using one a second, and this one is producing one a second. So that's six going to four of these. Oh, and it's supposed to supply. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to remove this. So with the up patch, the upgrade, we can also remove full belts. We can hold shift to mark a full belt. It's very very convenient it can also be used to find belts as you see it's going under everything but we can see very clearly where it goes that way but don't click if you don't want to remove it of course so removing this removing these and removing this that was extremely fast um, and then we add back the belt this way Good. So uh, now the smelters probably can't keep up and the mining probably can't keep up. Let's see. How about if we add this one in here? Oh, yeah, I'm going to make, I need to remove this whole shebang as well, all of it. And then we add it back like so. And can I do this without removing the box? Yes, and the box gone. So let's also, oh, let's do the upgrade button. Black off replace. Oh, oh, and we connected it to the wrong location. Oh, belt containment issues or belt issues. I don't know, belt, uh, what's it called? That word. Um, belt. Con contamination is the word I was looking for. Yeah, difficult words today. So <laughs> let's put this on the proper side. Let's also get some Mark II belts. I guess because we, we can't upgrade directly from, from Mark I to Mark III apparently. So we need to do it twice. So the Mark II belt is in here. We don't have many, but it's green. So let's find a big belt that's green. Uh, this this is green so if we upgrade this oh that's that's a big upgrade Pop. good then we have a stack or half a stack of mark 2 belts so let's see if that works yes good so then we add here and do we want to upgrade more of the belts, I don't know, but let's do it anyway because it's fun. So we aren't using that that many uh, cogs, gears, these things, gears. 
So let's connect these here as well. I guess that was about time. Uh, so let's upgrade the belt. Hooray. Now, do we or are we happy with this? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's a full Mark One belt, but we are using Mark Three belts now. So let's add a few more. As long as we have, as long as we have space for it. This already upgraded, and let's add the in sorters. That's it. There we go. Good. And then we need more mining. Do we have more? I guess I'm seeing it right over here. Yeah, that was a bit of uh, a bit of a plan we've been looking into for a while. The whole, the whole. Um, how do we want to get more? So instead of actually finding one in the building menu, I'm going to copy it. Oh. oh, that's good. Let's do one here. Oh, let's see if we can. Oh, oh. that's exciting. How many is that? 10. That's nice. Tens across the board. Let's see. And here we go. That's probably enough for now. So we connect everything let's see let's see where we want it now i have been told i should stop using or it might be time it was a very polite request <laughs> uh that uh that might be uh let's see it might be the time to um to use more logistic stations and less very long belts I'm going to add it here so it's uh, prioritized last. Uh, but I kind of like belts, and I also feel like power isn't isn't necessarily completely solved yet. So that's one of the reasons for it. I also really, really enjoy the look of long belts. So uh, I, I do I do get it though because. Like the, um, uh, what's it called? The uh, long belt for the processors. If you remember that one, that was a long belt. So maybe I shouldn't be as op opposed to making logistic stations as I am. Uh, yeah, maybe I shouldn't be. So we also need to connect this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to Let's see, split off and in, or, or, yeah, I guess that's fine. Uh, we don't really have room to split it though. Now I'm going to do something else. I'm going to remove these, and then I'm going to bring this belt over there. So that would be here and here then this one needs to be moved and there the nice thing about importing iron is that we get a new iron belt going down here in case we need for them all and it's also a bit easier to gauge i feel if if we don't have many belts going everywhere. Now, this belt is a bit slow, let's upgrade it. It wasn't saturated, so it wasn't needed, but I want it to. Um, so yes, this is going to be very expensive because I find this fun. And um, yeah, stuff that is fun is usually also expensive. Uh, I think every everything is moving as it should, but I don't think science is. So let's look into the science issue. I think, I think, let's see, 
Let's do some upgrading here as well, because that's fun. So, um, I guess, yeah, that belt, what was it already? It was Mark 1, yeah. So, this belt as well. I wonder why it didn't connect there. Maybe because it was two separate upgrades, I don't know. Here we go. Oh, these are green. Let's see if we can upgrade those as well. We can. Okay, so this patch seems so far, so far it seems amazing. Also, also we don't have hydrogen. Is that the issue with science? I don't think so. No, definitely not. Let's do I want bigger buffers? I feel like I feel like I want bigger buffers. No, I definitely the, the issue with science is the purple one. So um hydrogen can be fixed extremely, extremely easy by importing importing uh, hydrogen from space because we have the mining stations there. Let's see. So uh, it is actually crafting quite a lot. Uh, what are you lacking though? Why isn't it going faster, even faster? Let's see. So we do have enough particle broadbands for missing processors. Okay, so that's something we need to fix. But this isn't producing at all though. So missing this thing carbon nanotube. Now, those were used for something, right? Yeah, this thing, which is used for particle colliders and stuff. So I think, I think I'm going to uh, put some of these in a box. Um, let's do it here so it's easy to find. And there and power how much maybe two stacks just in case yeah um this power plant isn't extremely exciting either let's see so fire eyes is the issue uh, let's remove this because this is being shipped oh to the power plant okay so that's not incredibly exciting Do we feel like this belt isn't moving quick enough? This is, uh, it's a balance issue. So right now we have too much of this stuff. <laughs> yeah, way too much. So maybe the solution is cracking. It probably is, uh, but that's going to take some time. So I'm not going to set it up right now. I am, however, going to see if we can obtain some fire eyes and fix our processor issues. And processor issues, I believe we didn't have enough mining of silicon for those, if I remember it correctly. It's been a while. So, uh, oh yes, mining stations. So we have one, no, that's, so, uh, the, uh, oh, many thoughts going on at the same time. Let's get some of these, let's craft some of these. Uh, we can't craft them without the materials though. So let's get some materials. Um, the reason I'm not setting it up in the mall right now is because we don't have these and I want to fix that. Oh yes, that was my thought early in the episode as well. Let's see. So I, this belt is unnecessary. Yes, because that was for this. This box might be unnecessary as well. But what I was thinking with this is that these need, need sulfuric acid, steel and titanium ingots. So sooner or later we are going to import sulfuric acid. I don't like making it because if we find a planet with sulfuric acid oceans, that's better. So let's upgrade this belt and let's connect it to here 
also do we need titanium here i don't think we do so i'm going to lower the maximum so we stop importing it and i'm going to add another station uh somewhere probably over here because i want those kinds of materials in the mall but i also don't want to add it like in the middle of the mall uh, because i want the mall to be somewhat clean yeah let's use that word clean so let's temporarily not temporarily let's move the temporary to here we don't need that much so let's leave it at that do we want something else here now we probably this is probably where we want the processors or do we just belt it from there i don't know that's something we can fix when we want to fix it later this one is going to be is going to be uh, let's see sulfuric acid but we didn't want this anymore do we have room for everything no no way oh this is the perfect place to put it by why aren't you working this is one of those things right yeah the um, inserter had the steel and steel wasn't needed so let's remove that let's add sulfuric acid so what i'm going to do is i'm going to make these uh, automatically up at the planet with all the titanium that's the lava planet in the meantime let's leave the titanium here and here probably yes steel as well sure so these can just be producing and are the, these producing now yeah so those can just run so we're going to export um, export sulfuric acid from this planet for now and then when we get sulfuric water somewhere we're going to import it from there so let's make sure we uh, have enough belts and all the, the stuff before we go let's see belt icon yes good um, good we have much belt going on we also let's see let's grab them let's place this there we don't uh, we just need one stack actually actually let's place it in here yeah that's fine oh and yeah we we needed the miners i'm i'm doing several things at once i'm sorry about that so what do we need we need the uh <laughs> the steel and titanium we just dumped so let's get it back and make a few of these at least we have i was going to say at least we have the barbells but we don't really so let's import those as well uh that would be let's see we need this we need these uh we need remote demand we only need a thousand of those as well. Let's lower this to a thousand as well. Promote demand. That won't matter for now. It won't matter yet, anyway. So let's do the handcrafting. We also need these. We have a bunch of them at least. Yeah, that's nice. So now we just need, uh, how many? Four. Are four going to be enough? I think that's going to be more than enough. So let's go here, clear inventory, dump it on the belt. Just holding the button down now. Oh, it's not enough. I guess, I guess we didn't, we didn't have that many left, so we can, oh, they only take 20, that's fine, so there we go, 
Ooh, what else now? We were going to make these, yes. So we were going to make four of them, just to be sure. So that's one, two, three, and four. Oh, we also need to automate. We also need to automate these. And what I was thinking is that how about we use this station for accumulators? So what we want, we need two slots, one for each. So we import the empty ones. So the empty ones go, let's see, or the full ones can go here and in. And the empty ones can be, that was at the correct location already. We connect those here so they get charge. And then uh, we get one of these and get the full ones. That way we load them. We probably don't need 10,000 though, so let's stop at 1,000. We also need four stacks of them. Let's see, one, two, three, and four to make these. Oh, and then we need all of these. So uh, we have let's see, five. We need 100 for each, I think, if I remember it correctly. So that would be 100 for each. So one, two, three, and four. Our inventory is so full. That's my bad, though, by fault, because I have so many things. So let's get rid of some of them, at least. Here, for instance, yes. Good. A bit easier to get rid of stuff if you have a free slot. So why are we holding holding all of this? Yeah, why? Oh, it's okay. Oh, we have this box. So we can stuff it in that box. So we need uh, eight stacks of the green ones then. Three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. Is that enough for four? Did we already make one? Yes. So one, two, and three. Good. So this is going to take five minutes ish. Uh, so let's 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 what? Let's decide what we're going to do. We're going to fix these, and also, oh yes, we were going to make a small array for. Uh, for the, oh, the, these, these. So we don't need much. So we need a bunch of smelters, that's it. And miners, miners and smelters. Smelters we have, miners we have. So I guess we just go while these are being made. Uh, so if we now go to the lava planet, that's, which one is that? It's the one that's not firing the sails. So it's the number one planet. I think I'm going to check just in case. Yeah, th this is the one with loads of materials. So that's good. Um, let's look at the handcrafting. Yeah, it's still a while, so Let's get that on the way back. This means our science will be slow today, but that's fine. We're only upgrading the efficiency anyway. We aren't making anything new and exciting. Oh, and we landed exactly where we wanted to. Good. So, you are doing fine. You don't have these, and you don't have silicon. So that's, that's what we suspected. So do we have a full belt out? Uh, I don't know. We don't have enough smelting going on. So this is 20, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, including seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So let's add, let's upgrade just in case. Good. So let's add 10 more. 
because they do use one a second, right? Yes. So let's add, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. I've been practicing my numbers, so now, uh, now I have learned that seven comes after six. Let's see, let's add some fuel. Oh, I was, yeah, I worried there for a second. So, um, there we go. There we go. I wonder how they're going to do blueprints in this game if they are with the grid misalignment and stuff. There we go. I guess it's going to be like heavily requested though. And there we go. So that should help. Let's see now if the belt empties out. It's not it's not a full belt, I think. No. Let's add one more. This is a bit brutish, I guess. Just uh, plopping down a new one on the same uh, patch, but it's it's the best way to do it right now, I think, because this planet doesn't have a lot of silicon. Uh, the the solar system doesn't have a lot of silicon. So that was that. Now we have the the uh, miners, orbital miners. Oh, we don't. We have them soon. So that's good. We also need to, oh, we need to look into the barbell because apparently I connected smelters to each other. And that's, that's not what we were supposed to do. Is it here? No, this is the mining outpost. Oh, it's so slow. That poor belt. It's working hard. So I guess it's in this location. Yes. So you need green engines. Green engines need these things. These things don't need anything. It needs more magnets. And that's good, I guess, because that's, here's the mistake. Yeah. Five yellow signs. And we connected the uh, inserters to the other smelters instead of to the belt. That's extremely, well, it's the opposite of useful. So it's extremely not useful. Extremely was a bad way to start that sentence. There we go. Here we have issue as well. Apparently we don't have inserters at all here. So that's also extremely not useful. Good. Um, that should definitely help a bit. Now everything is actually running. Yeah. So that's fixed. And now we need to do the part with the sulfuric acid. So let's find a location with both uh, iron and titanite, titanium, let's say, that we aren't mining. So maybe here. Yeah, that's nice. So that would be here. I feel like it's too close though to, is this interstellar? Yeah. I don't want to use the same thing and I want them a bit spread out because I don't want to build like a metropolis. Oh, here it's good. Yeah, that, that's great. That's great. So I don't want, um, let's see. I don't want too many logistic stations in the same locations because I feel like those are almost like waypoints or, well, they're pretty large. So, how many of 
the things do we want? Um, and let's find the north. That was exactly where we were pointing. And there we go. So you are going to make these. And you make four, four every 12 seconds. So that's one every three seconds. So that's one every second. That's probably enough. So let's double it up. Let's, yeah, do it the engineering way. Find the breakpoint, double it up and done. Um, good. So what do you need? Two a second, right? So that means two steel a second. So let's make that. How quickly do you actually make steel? Two a second, so we need six of them. So that's two, three, four, five, and six. And that means we're going to need the, uh, is this too close now? Yeah, so we need it. Oh, not there, but there. Then we set the recipe. Uh, iron ingot. These are one every second, and these need three every three seconds. So that's one to one ratio, just making sure. Good. So that's the. That's the uh, steel part. I really need to pay attention when I'm placing these. But here we actually want to, to place. Oh, I misaligned it. Where well, we actually want to place. Um, what am I trying to say? The inserter is going from smelter to smelter. Yes. So that's one belt. Good. Then we also need the titanium. So that can go here. Titanium. So we need six of these as well. Because, wait, no. Two is one a second, so we need four, right? Because we're going to make for I lost count completely we need two a second I think that's the plan two a second yes so we need four does this eat two a second it does yes okay so that's correct now good so we have in belt then we have out belt Let's bring the belt this way as well, like so. Mm -hmm. Now we need some mining as well. I'm going to overkill it. I'm not going to count because that's that's the kind of day I have today. It, it's weird how some days are like number days and some days are like not <laughs> so let's hope that's overkill because overkill is what we're going for just need to check the direction of the belt it looks like it's going that way so we go here 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 And inserters here in in out in out. Good. So this is in in. I think I'm going to do the sulfuric acid on the other side. 
so we don't have any. Let's see. We, we don't get any three belt things because this this array isn't very complicated or very large, so it should be completely fine with that. So one, one. I want to hit those two. That's one. Oh, yes. Sir. Missing one in the middle here. So let's bring, let's include that one as well. There we go. And there. And there. I think that's fine. I also think that uh, we're going to blow the power grid now on this planet. So that's something I guess we need to plan ahead for as well. So maybe with all the miners we make, we can make uh, orbital miners, sorry. We can make some power plant burning off excess uh, hydrogen, but we'll see. So that's the steel. Does this, or oh, we can place it in the middle here. Yeah, good. Let's try to connect everything to each other. Also, I was thinking power. Maybe we do the power like uh, a separate grid instead of connecting. No, it's not very far. So, so we can definitely, definitely connect. I'm going to use these power poles because I, uh, on this planet I don't want the drain from uh, from the big power pole. There we go. Still 100% satisfaction. So, oh, it's going to be very fun to see when we connect the uh, logistics though. But I guess we can't because, oh, we can. Because we are making pink barbells. Uh, this is the first time, uh, as many people probably know, but you can, um, you can click the logistations from space and you can also pick up items from them. This is the first time I've been, I'm going, just going to show you with one. There we go, I need to not train. So that works. I don't like it. I don't like being able to teleport items like that. And I also like to fly in this game. So um, I know that might seem very silly. And I guess in some ways it is. Let's see, 15. Let's do a bit more. Let's do that. Good. Um, but I don't like to uh, play an early access game like this is and try to break the game or kind of cheat the system when, when it's most likely, or hopefully at least, something that will get fixed. That's my thoughts on that at least but but it's a nice thing to know I guess that you can you can grab stuff from the other side of the planet if you click a logistic stations uh, station and that's also what you can do with them all if you add all of the items from them all to a log logistic station then you can uh, then you can uh, uh, reach them all from anywhere on the planet so that's probably convenient until it gets fixed. Hopefully it gets fixed. So this is going to be here, I guess. Yes. And then we connect. Let's see how many goes into it. Uh, the outer belt is going to be one from because we, uh, we want to 
we want to use the, the lowest amount of um, inserter movements as possible. Then here, let's see, we have sulfuric acid. Sulfuric acid in and uh, titanium alloy out. This is going to have a big buffer, and that's fine. Remote demand. I guess we're going to have a big buffer of this as well. Maybe not right now, but I don't want to change it later. So let's also add 10 of these because this is going to be a bit, a bit of moving stuff. So let's connect it and completely blow up the system now. It might not actually completely blow it up. 30 megawatts maximum. It is going to use a bit of, of power we don't have, but that's that's completely fine. So um, we have an out here. I guess, well, if we need more slots, we're going to move one of the belts, but it's fine like this. There we go. This is nice. I've been looking forward to automating all of the mall parts because it's going to be awesome to just import them into the mall. We can make we can make a logistic station that imports five different materials, and then um, we can we can make uh, at least these. So is that it? I'm not sure if we built everything correctly. It's always a bit hard to tell. But I, I guess, oh, no wonder it's training power. Yeah. It's, it's good like this though. It's moving a lot of it and we're going to run out pretty quickly. It's just going to move all our buffer here. But it looks like everything is fine now. Let's see how close they are. Are you sulfuric acid? Probably. I'm going to expect it to be sulfuric acid because I want to see this moving before I leave. I have a tendency to mess up an inserter or a five and then if we leave we have to we have to come back and uh, that takes more time than waiting. And also we can look at our little little outpost here. It looks nice. I like the outpost in this game. They uh, look, I don't know, neat and clean. And this isn't like, um, I don't know. It's, yeah, it's nice. We have the space for it and come on. Come on. Sulfuric acid, yes. Good, good. I like the color on that one. Or maybe it was just the lighting. I don't know. Okay. So we have everything. Uh, we don't have enough power. That's, that's okay though. That's something we can definitely fix. Uh, and the important part is to be producing some. And I also think that it will drain less and less, uh, less and less, yeah, less and less power. It seems so slow, but I think it's fine because they produce four at a time. So let's, let's place the miners now. I think we, did we forget something now? We did fix our mistakes at the uh, barbells. We increased the silicon mining. I don't think we have enough silicon mining. Uh, we probably don't have enough pr uh, the um, being produced at all on the processors because the next science need them as well. Uh, but I think, um, 
I think we're going to look into tomorrow problems tomorrow. Wait, we can't do we can't do everything in one episode. And today we're going to fix the problems we actually have. And this oh, this is nice. Four new miners, and that's going to that's going to fix everything. It's not going to fix everything, but it's going to fix some things. One, two. I also, let's see, when I hovered the tooltip, I thought I saw something interesting. Let's see. Yeah, they have a gathering speed of 11.2, which means they produce a whole lot of fire eyes because the rate on that is uh, 0.58 a second. So 11 times that is quite a lot, but it doesn't look like it's producing that much. And that's probably because it burns some of it. So I'm not sure how that works, but it would be nice if we could select um, which fuel it's using. I see they've removed the uh, bar here to charge it, which is fine. Uh, but it would be nice to say burn hydrogen instead of fire ice and so on. So we prioritized which ones we wanted to obtain and which ones we wanted the orbital miner to use as fuel. So where's our planet? The other side. All base on the other side. Yeah, there we go. Oh, coming in fast. Plop. Okay. Oh, and slap dab in the middle of science. So I guess this won't update for. Oh, oh. We have a bit of fuel issue. So this is at zero. Um, so we're going to. We're going to fly back. We're going to get some fuel. Everything is working as intended. We have a lot of science here. We don't have enough hydrogen. But I think as long as we aren't doing that much science, it's not an issue. But if it becomes an issue, how do we want to do this then? Yeah, I don't know. We can add another that request from the miners and add it here and turn priority down. Yeah, that, that's going to completely fix it. But I'm going to let it run for now because I'm curious to see where it ends up when we get more science. Because for now we have enough red science anyway. But we have we have a fix if a fix is needed as well. So I guess that's good. We have all the sulfuric acid being picked up. That's also nice. We have 720 of these and we added the miners. So now that we have, let's see, we have the processors, we have the uh, particle containers and we have the uh, titanium alloy. So we might be able to set these up now. We also need to set up these, which is titanium alloy. And of course, engines we have. And yeah, engines, of course. Yeah, so that's, that's nice. Uh, we're getting somewhere now. We have, um, we have the stuff being requested already. Oh, that's nice. So we have automation. That's good. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with uh, cleaning up some of the, some of the, I was going to say mistakes, but let's call it, let's call it slightly unoptimized stuff. This is good. It looks like it's also buffering everything and nice. We have a chest that 
is already full with two stacks of those. That's nice because we can make particle containers from these. Yeah, because this is everything is made. Everything is made. So that means we can either. Let's see. Yeah, I don't know, but I want the Dyson Sphere. That, that's the thing. So we're going to look into that later. For now, I think we're going to destroy stuff like this because we don't need it anymore. And we're going to stash it here. And then we're going to call it. But, but that was nice. I feel like we made quite a few improvements actually. And also, I'm going to do that because belts are definitely, uh, I guess, obviously, but it's something we're going to use a lot of. Um, so just keeping one stack of the lower one, that's that one, yeah, should be fine. So uh, with a new patch, everything is a bit more smooth and everything makes me kind of happy with the quick belts and the upgrades and everything seems to work great. I also didn't expect the group dismantle or the full belt and I really really like that as well. The developers did good. So thank you all for watching and I hope you enjoyed the spaghetti. Bye bye.